All right. Thought I had a goddamn problem. The light wasn't coming on. So this is a uh, 1611 uh, King James. Nothing too crazy. It's gonna be chapter 20. Uh, 20 boom through 21. Okay. Um, so let us, let us begin, let us begin, let us, let us, let us, oh man, okay, um, Hezekiah having received a message of death by prayer has his life lengthened, um, the sun goeth 10 degrees backward for a sign of that promise. Berotic Baladan sending to visit Hezekiah because of the wonder have notice of his treasures. Isaiah understanding thereof for tell of the Babylonian cap captivity. Manasseh succeeded Hezekiah. In those days, Hezekiah is sick unto death, and the prophet Isaiah, the son of Amos, came to him and said unto him, Thus saith the Lord, Set thine house in order, for thou shalt die and not live. Then he turned his face to the wall and prayed unto the Lord, saying, I beseech thee, O Lord, remember now how I have walked before thee in truth and with the perfect heart, and have done that which is good in thy sight. And Hezekiah wept so. And it came to pass, for Isaiah was going out into the middle coat, that the word of the Lord came to him, saying, Turn again, and tell Hezekiah, the captain of my people, thus saith the Lord, the God of David thy father. I have heard thy prayer. I have seen thy tears. Behold, I will heal thee on the third day. Thou shalt go up into the house of the Lord, and I will add unto thy days fifteen years, and I will deliver thee in this city out of the hand of the king of Assyria. And I will defend this city for mine own sake, and for my servant David's sake. And Isaiah said, Take a lump of figs. And they took and laid it upon the bowl, and he recovered. And Hezekiah said unto Isaiah, what shall be the sign that the Lord will heal me, and that I shall go up into the house of the Lord the third day? And Isaiah said, This sign shalt thou have of the Lord, that the Lord will do the thing that he has spoken. Shall the shadow go forward ten degrees, or go back ten degrees? And Hezekiah answered, It is a light thing for me, the shadow, to go down ten degrees. Nay, but let the shadow return backward ten degrees. And Isaiah the prophet cried unto the Lord, and he brought the shadow ten degrees backwards, by which it had gone down into the dial of Ahaz. At that time, Beredek, Baladin, the son of Baladin, king of Babylon, sent letters and a president to Hezekiah. For he had heard that Hezekiah had been sick, and Hezekiah hearkened unto them, and shewed them the house of his precious things, the silver and the gold and the spices and the precious ointment in all the house of his armor and all that was found in his treasures there was nothing in his house nor in all his dominion that Hezekiah shewed them not then came Isaiah the prophet unto king Hezekiah and said unto him what said these men and from whence came they unto thee and Hezekiah said they are come from a far country even from Babylon and he said what have they seen in thine house. And Hezekiah answered, All the things that are in mine house have they seen. There is nothing among my treasures that I have not shewed them. And Isaiah said unto Hezekiah, Hear the word of the Lord. Behold, the days come that all that is in thine house, and that which thy fathers have laid up on and store up to this day, unto this day, shall be carried into Babylon. Nothing shall be left, saith the Lord. And of thy sons, that shall issue from thee, which thou shalt beget, shall thou take away, and they shall be 
eunuchs, eunuchs, and the palace of the king of Babylon. Then said Hezekiah to Isaiah, Good is the word of the Lord which thou hast spoken. And he said, Is it not good? If peace and truth may be in my days, and the rest of the acts of Hezekiah and all his might, and how he made a pool and a conduit and brought water into the city, are they not written in the book of the Chronicles of the kings of Judah? Hezekiah slept with his fathers, and Manasseh his son reigned in his stead. And that was it. Chapter 20 through 21. Keep God first.